Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. You, both of you, come. Did you or did you not see me pass? Adaku, we are not blind. Oh, <laughs> we are not blind. And what happens to greeting people dressed in royalty? Ah, no, no, me cheer. Okay. That you're dressed in royalty doesn't make you royal, Adaku. What insolence! If not that today is a happy day for me, I would have matched the palace guards to your parents' houses each and have them flogged right under the sun <laughs> for raising both of you with such disrespect. <laughs> Inukwa. Hey! Adako, you seem to be forgetting something. We are all friends in this village. That the prince found favor in you and decided to date you doesn't make us any less than you are. <laughs> oh, but well, you are lesser now. Oh. Yes. Look. I am royalty, and if you want us to still remain as friends, then you must acknowledge it. Please, let's go. Don't mind that. When she's done, Jimmy, she'll wait for When my prince comes back to take his throne, and I become the queen, remind me to employ those maidens. Yes, my lady. They shall walk under me, and they shall be posted to the restroom. That is where their kinds belong. Don't make me forget. Yes, my lady. Can you imagine Adaku carrying herself as royalty when she's not even married to the prince or king to be? King to be where? In this village. Akuko. Story. Hmm. But let me ask you, do you really think that Igwe Ochie will surrender the crown after testing the throne? That has been my thoughts exactly. But why would the prince stay this long in the white man's land after hearing about the death of his father? You see that question eh? Only the prince can answer that question when he stands before the elders and the kingmakers, not mm. me. But I, I heard his to return next week. Okay. All right now. Let eh? uh -huh. them. Oh, take care. Oh. Bye bye. Bye bye. King, he sent for me. Sit. Now that your son is coming back, what is your plan for him? I don't understand. What plan? You know he has no place here. Why not? Because I don't want him here. I, I 
don't need him. He will be better off at your maternal kingdom uh, as a prince. Send him to your maternal kingdom. Yes. This is his father's house. He has every right, just like every royal blood in this family. Except the one that sits on the throne. Send him to Akugo Kingdom. That is my decision. My son remains with me. What? Yes. Are you questioning my orders? Huh? How dare you? If not for one thing, I would have had your head on a platter. You are here, right now, talking to me because I chose to inherit you. I, I, I used to be in love with you when I was younger. But he said I was too young for you and followed my elder brother. Now the table has turned. You belong to me. You must do as I say. Treat me as a king. Still, my son. Leave my presence at once. Leave! <laughs> If not for tradition, I would have turned you to a slave. So it is true, mother. You decided to move on with that heartless uncle of mine. Like father meant nothing to you. I did choose to, so I did it. Tradition demanded I'm inherited if I must remain within the walls of this palace. I can't leave this palace. I can't. Why not, mother? You are still a child. There are so much you don't understand. Your father made a lot of enemies when he was alive. People who wanted us out, people who wanted to pull us down at all costs. I have to remain within the protective shield of this palace. My father was a good man. Sure, he was. But you know these days, Good people make a lot of enemies. You know that. There are a lot of people who want things in their favor to the detriment of the poor. They are coming after us, son. They are coming after us. <sighs> but mother, why marry him? Why? There was no other way. So what's going to happen now? Well, Adaku, the other says it's too late already. They said another from the royal house. Where's the crowd? Another from the royal house? Yes, Even when the heir to the throne is here. What do you want me to do, Adaku? I can't possibly fight my uncle. You know he has most of the kingmakers on his side. Just listen to yourself, he came back. You're not helping me, Adaku. Listen to yourself, he came back. Just listen to yourself. You can't fight your uncle. What even took you long anyways? Well, my um, travel document got delayed. My uncle actually knew about this. He could have begged the others to wait. But rather, he chose to be crowned. Just imagine. Hmm. So, you're just going to leave him to sit on the throne just like that? Hey, Kimba, you will just leave him like that? Well, I have told the entire village that I am going to be the next queen of this kingdom. And I'm not ready to walk away from it just like you're about to do. That could queen you will be. The gods are wise. The gods are wise. The gods are not wise. The gods are not wise. The gods are slow. I am not ready to wait for them. Look, 
They came back. I have better things to do. I'll be on my way. And that you're not leaving. We just got here. I'm busy. Adaku. Adaku. Ah, there calls my good friend. <laughs> my prince and my brother. Ah, <laughs> Where are you going to this beautiful sunset? Ah, ah, I was coming to see you, of course. My good friend. <laughs> well, I heard of your return. So I started to come pay a visit before your normal real reception. Ah, you're a good man. You've always been a good man. You were 18 when you left this kingdom. And I was 21. Yeah. Agu. You never fail to remind me that you are older than me. But that's the truth. Hmm? Are you coming or not? Where are you going to? To your place, of course. <laughs> okay. <laughs> me huge money to get married. The gods finally blessed me. I must sell it. The king of Orienta is an arch enemy to King Uchi. You can recruit some guards to go see him. He can help you get the throne if you promise to give him the land behind the great shrine. And of course you know that he has the greatest fighter in the whole region. You can't just fold your hands. Well, Adako, you know my father is a man of peace. He would turn in his grave if I do that which you ask of me. Ikemba, your father is already turning in his grave for refusing to do your royal duty. Well, it's my fault, Ada. I should have called home every day. And then your mother, she doesn't even care. Her phones were stolen. The very day my father died. Stolen? A, a thief? A thief in the palace? No. No. That doesn't add up. Look, you need to fight for what is yours. Ada, my mother forbids me from fighting the crown. Oh, yeah. That's because she's still the queen. She has nothing to lose. Ada, shall I take my leave now? Hmm? I shall take my leave. Ikemba. Mother. Ikemba, I will not walk that lane with you. No. I am born for royalty. And if you don't fight for what belongs to you, I will leave this village and go get married to a prince far away. Ike, eh? <laughs> where have you been? Uh, I went to the bush to shake my traps. Hey, yes, hey, I go. <laughs> my brother, this one makes sense. Uh. <laughs> well, hey. clean it, eh? Roast it for Papa. Hey. Let me go inside and quickly change. I want to go and see the prince. You want to go and see the prince? Yes, sir. No problem, no problem. <laughs> I go, I go. Hey, Papa go like this one. Don't worry. Yeah, <laughs> hey. I go, I go. Hey. Offer it for Papa. It's a lasso. It's a lasso. Hey. 
What went wrong? I know for sure that Venom of Vipers does nothing to the pack of a tortoise. Most of all, the woman you cherish most is now married to your own brother, my uncle. You never move out without enough gas. Why too? Why too, Nana? He came back. What's wrong? You didn't even notice my presence. Agu, you won't understand. Something is definitely wrong. Eh? Kim, I was wrong. Agu, I don't think my father's death was an ordinary attack from the Nibori kingdom. Eh? Where have you heard that the king of a kingdom was assassinated by another kingdom? I mean, there should have been war. The others did nothing, of course. Okay, man. Agu. They said that they are not sure since they left no trace behind. That's it. Nonsense. What's that? You believe that? That. You came back. How are you? You're busy in the farm. That, that's very good. It's wonderful. It's wonderful. I don't know how to really make you understand that I, I like you. Is there any way you can submit yourself to me so I begin to take care of you? None. Eh? Please, leave me alone. I am a widow. I want to live in peace. Please, let me be. Let you do what? Let you be. Let you be in my own farm. Let you be. Nani. Oh no, Wu. You know that my late husband left this piece of land for me to work on. Oh no, Wu. Leave my farm land. Leave, leave, leave which, which, whose farm? What are you talking about? You know what I found out? Since you are stingy in everything I've been trying to do with you, you leave this farm. <laughs> leave here! Get out! <laughs> if you don't get out, if you must get out or... You don't get out. Oh no, or what? I ask you, or what? Oh, if you think I am afraid of you in this village, then you are making a very big mistake. Uh -huh. I am not. And I will never. Let no. me tell you. Leave this well, you, you will leave. You will see it now. If a woman begins to look for what killed her husband, that thing that killed her husband will kill her. <laughs> Let me go and come. Mm. Wait for me. Mm. Yes. I am waiting. Wait. I take this man alone. <laughs> me. Ha, not a came mouth. You can do it without videos in this village. A kema is ready for anybody. Hey, 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 stop what you're doing, my son. Well, now what are you doing here again? Wait, so you have the mind to talk back at my father? Who is this? Eh? Who are you? Take her away! Take her away. Go on, where is she? Where is she? Where is she? 
Enough, woman. What troubles you? We were the only piece of land my late husband left for me. Oh no, who has been fighting with me over that land? Igwe, please, don't allow him to take it from me. Please, Igwe. Woman, Igwe. it's enough. Enough. Go and make peace with Ono. You can leave my presence. I have other things of greater concern. Igwe, please. Igwe. Leave. Please. Guys. Igwe, The voice of the gods. What brings you to the palace this early? I, I hope it's good news. Huh? I shall give you the message as given by the gods. Mm. Mm. I'm listening. Mm. Talk to me. I do not have time for pleasantries. For the gods are angry. Yes! The gods are angry! They say to you, How long will you be keeping what is not yours? Hmm? Hmm. more. listen to me. When you're done prancing, your way out of this palace at once. <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> Send it out. <laughs> oh, when the wind blows, it will surely leave nothing untouched. Nonsense. Because I've spoken. <laughs> This is my home. Prophecy. The stars and the moon knew their path. They only crossed paths when invited by the gods.
this kind of heavy load? My son, I don't have anybody to help me. <laughs> oh, don't worry, don't worry. My name is Sago. I will help you. Thank you, my son. Where are you heading to? I'm going to us. Oh, gee, river. Good house, this room. Let me at least take it to your house, then I'll go back. You have done more than enough. Let go now. Are you sure? Hey. Okay. Hey, hey. Sorry. We'll meet again.
afternoon, your highness. A token of love from Ono, my father. Oh. <laughs> Tell your father he's a friend of the crown. I never knew he had such a beautiful daughter. <laughs> Thank you, my king. And you are? Adaku, my king. Adaku? Yes, my king. How come I've never set my eyes on you? My king, I haven't been much around since you returned from the city. The last time I saw you was during your late brother's coronation. I was a teenager then. Mm. We shall have a word soon. Say me well to your father. I will, my king. For you, it was never for you, it was for us. Royalty, <laughs> uh -huh. how does it feel to be a commoner? <laughs> I am royalty, Obia. royalty is in my blood, and with or without Prince Ikimba, royalty will not depart from me. Hi, <laughs> I thought she has woken up. Please, my dear, let's not waste our saliva on this dreamer. dreamer. And when I'm done dreaming, both of you will be spending the rest of your life as slaves. Akuko. <laughs> Upe. Upe, Upe. So say it, the queen. Hi. Her majesty. Lolo. <laughs> I am a daddy. I am the daughter of Onowu Akide. Granddaughter of Ekezie Okosisi. I will have both of you regret this. Don't go for something. Nazo! Nazo! You have been around the village. Lately, what do people think? Do they think I should be ashamed? No. People think you are blessed with beauty. And good thing will come to you at the right time. Good. Take a look at your backside, you understand how beautiful you are, man, your man. Oh no, Akidi, what are you doing here? Why ask such a question? After all you've done to me? Oh, you feel untouchable. Because the king has made you a right-hand man of evil. I will find justice. <laughs> I will! Take it easy, man, your man. That's why I am here. I've come to make amends. We will settle. Oh? You know, first of all, you got me angry. That's why I got angry. But I'm throwing everything now to the evil forest. See, I'll give you that land. Take, take all of it. Even the one close to Ingeni River, I'll give you everything. Everything. Yes, please, please. 
See, I've not been sleeping because I've been thinking about you. Over my dead body! Oh no, if you cannot sleep, then go to the evil forest and mount guard there. Yes! Go and mount guard at the evil forest. You said what over your dead body? You heard me! That's a threat. That's a threat! And I'll tell you, I'll demonstrate to you that a perfect dancer does not lose dancing steps because he's getting old. It is with me forever. Good dancing. Over your dead body, that's what came out from your mouth. You heard what I came out say. Okay. Yes. Go and prepare. Over your dead body, that's what. Hmm, Adak, why have you been avoiding me lately? He came but I've been very busy. <laughs> busy, you say? You've been too busy to see me, your prince. <laughs> your prince? First of all, you are not a prince. And secondly, I was busy with things that make me happy. Hmm. And you know what? I think you should concentrate more on trying to understand your purpose in life. Just take a look around. A whole lot have changed. And if you don't see it, I wonder why we're here anyways. I would love to take my leave. My prince, if that's what will make you happy. Adaku! Adaku! You know how much I love you, Adaku? is a fresh wine. Chai! So fresh and sweet? Always fresh for the king. I always trust you. <laughs> <laughs> so my king, what, what is it that bothers you this time around? Oh no. There's no problem this time around. Okay. You know you have always wanted me to take a young queen yes. that could bear me an heir. As you know, I cannot have kids with my late brother's old wife. I see with you. I see with you. So, is there any maiden in our community that has uh, found favor in your sight? Just let me know. We go to the family, fetch the girl, and then begin the process. Hmm. No. Your daughter. She swept me off my feet the last time I saw her. I want to make her my queen. You know why it's so unique? That's why I'm going to go to square. You have my consent? She's all yours. <laughs> eh? Don't look back. Ah. Fix the date and we begin the wedding without delay. Oh no. Hey! I trust you. Ah. I've always trusted you, my good friend. Hey! Ah. My own daughter! <laughs> oh! God! Pour us more pan wine. Ah, ah. This is worth celebrating. Yes! <laughs> In a way, it's only case of wine. I want a village square. Oh, no. Ah, ah. My king. 
have called you to inform you on time. In the next four market days, I shall be picking a new bride. So, pack your things and move them to the guest quarters. That is where you will stay from this moment. Because my new wife will be in the queen's room as expected. That has been my room for about two decades now. Can't we just... Can't we just what? I have warned you never to question my orders. Tell the guards and the maidens to help you move your things to the, to the guest quarters at once. That is my decision and it stands. Right now! I love this girl. I love this girl. I love this girl. I love this girl. I love her. That girl. You came my friend. I go. She has already proclaimed herself as the next queen of this kingdom. Your refusal to fight for the throne has brought her so much shame. What am I to do, I go? What do you expect me to do? I can't possibly fight he who sits on the throne. <laughs> You know, I can't do this. In fact, can you imagine? I even begged her. I begged her to, 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 to run away with me to another kingdom. But she refused. She did, she refused. <coughs> See, the woman who is determined to fulfill her destiny does not listen to such. Give her time, she will come. She will see this with you. But in the meantime, I will talk to her. I go. I go, you should talk to her. He came by eat. I'll talk to her. What is this? What is the joy in eating? What? I said I will talk to her. Eat. Hi, I will talk to her. Don't worry. Eat. I will talk to her. Don't worry. Adak. Adak. Please don't do this. He came by will die if you leave him. He can't even eat anymore. Oh, stop singing love poems to me. I saw both of you eating yam and oil. Yes. Now let me ask you, what makes a man a man? You tell me. A man is a man if he can fight for what belongs to him. And if he can't, no woman will feel safe being with him. As a hunter, if you see a leopard running towards you, in the jungle, what will you do? <laughs> they are much. I run. But there is one. I shoot. Good. Knowing when to run and when to shoot and fight is what makes you a man. But your friend is far from it. Your friend is a coward. And you don't expect a woman like me, Adako, to be seen around the coward. No. When he's ready to marry a lethal woman like me, he should pick up his nerves and fight for what belongs to him. He's thrown. Adako, Adako, sit down. Adako. That is you, Adako. How could you? My own uncle. My very own uncle. Ah! I told you I'm not ready to wait for you. I told you, have you forgotten? Look, if a god eventually answers your prayers and restores the truth to you, you're more than fine. That is if they do in your next one. You can as well go get a queen for yourself. Mother, are you staying on this? Is this you? 
Yes, this is me. Look, if you don't have shame, I don't have shame. All the meetings in this village are making me laugh and stop. Why are you so desperate for out? You know what? This marriage, this marriage will never work. <laughs> it has worked already. It's work, Anna. What's your problem now? Wait, why are you taking it as if I'm your birthright? Hmm? If you use this energy to fight for the throne, which is your birthright, everything will be fine. When you said no, it came back. You chose not to fight. You're not even ready for marriage. Adaku! Adaku! of reckoning upon everyone. Reckon, you see. First, it was my throne. Now, the love of my life. And you ask me not to fight. <sighs> Wait on the gods. That is why you are alive today. I lost your father. I don't want to lose you. But mother, how are we sure that my father the king was ambushed and killed by the warriors of Azudo. If so, why can't my uncle wage war against the people that spilled the blood of the king, his brother? Only the gods can answer that. The gods are wise. Don't worry, I can smell you already. <laughs> and the you're so sensitive. What did you perceive? Okay, tell me, how do I smell? Do I smell like farm or grass cutter? <laughs> you smell like my sister. Oh, come here. <laughs> did you take good care of yourself? Okay, let me go and prepare your food for you, okay? Thank you for being my eyes and my parts. You don't have to thank me. I am your sister. And you are my blood. You are my responsibility. So don't thank me, okay? Hmm? So now, naughty, naughty girl. I said don't thank me again, okay? Mm. Let me go and prepare your food. I can, yeah. I'm very happy. Oh, yeah, you should be. <laughs> Naturally, you should be. So let it be as we have discussed. Okay. The drilling okay. starts next month. And you know what that means. Are, are you telling me? Are you telling me? <laughs> <laughs> so as soon as the papers are ready, yeah. you head for Abuja. Oh. I can't wait for that date to fast forward. Yeah. Yes. yes, yes the yes, time yes, is yes, now. Yes, okay, 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 okay. okay. Yeah. So. I win, <laughs> queen of the land, take good and proper care of the king. I will, Papa. I implore you. <laughs> I implore you. <laughs> oh, no. The king, I'm going. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Papa. Okay. Farewell. My 
queen. What makes your heart sorrowful? I'm fine. No. It doesn't look like it. I mean, your heart is broken. And I know it's only a woman that can do this to you. Your throne was taken and you didn't shed a tear. So why now? Who are you? Amada. My prince. Please cheer up. You were a good person. And I know the gods will comfort you. They will fulfill all your heart desires, including your throne and a deserving woman when the time is right. Okay? But you know nothing about me. The gods have forsaken me. No, my prince. The gods do not forsake the pure in heart. You just don't know how closely they watch you. See, this life is filled with a lot of bad people. And just a few good ones. And the good ones make it worth living. And you are one of them. Please, just be strong. Your kingdom needs you. Your people need you. Just, just be hopeful, for there are better days ahead. Please. You speak wisdom. Who are your parents? My... My parents, I... My parents died nine years ago. Um, they were killed when the warriors from the neighboring village attacked us. I'm only left with my blind sister. Ah. My heart grieves for your loss. We have life. We can only thank the gods for keeping us. Please, I, I think I should be on my way. Right. Please, if you don't mind, I think you should also go home. Home? Yes. That place annoys me. I would have gone to my friend's place, Agu, but he went for the hunter's meeting. All right then, be my guest. I mean, come with me to my house. My, my place is not very far from here. And my sister will be so excited <laughs> to meet you. Your words already gladdens my heart. Go home, go back to your sister. She needs you. She no. needs you. My prince, it's not good to be lonely. Please, just, just come with me. Adora, is that you? Yes, it's me. This is my sister, Didi. How? Oh, Didi, how are you? Who is that? Ada? <laughs> you finally gave him a chance. <laughs> there she goes again. He's not my man. He's just a friend. It's Prince Ikemba. Oh! My Prince! <laughs> prince Ikemba in our home? So I'm here. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome to our home. My prince, please, let me get you something. Sure, sure. Thank you. My prince, are you still there? Oh, I'm here, sure. <laughs> My uh, prince. 
Yes. <laughs> Please don't break my sister's heart. Oh. She has refused so many suitors so she can take care of me. Mm. Bringing you home means she adores you a lot. Ah. Please, my prince, don't break her heart. <laughs> uh, NDD, please, let the prince rest. I told you he's only my friend. My prince, please, I'm coming. All right, all right, sure. So they are the new maidens employed yesterday. I told you this day will come. <laughs> so he's laughing now. <laughs> Royalty is in my blood. I told you. Take them to the toilet. That will be their point of duty. That is where you belong. Inukwa. Adu. Hi! Me, I'm not staying in this palace. So I can't serve Adaku. And who says we are serving Adaku? We are not serving Adaku, my sister. We are not. We are serving the palace, not Adaku. Besides, this, you know, this job is better than that farm work we usually do. Look at my hand. Eh? Hey. One thing I'll tell you is that if she misbehaves with us, eh, we'll show her that we are not her slaves. Yes. How kind of nonsense is this? Did you hear her? Can you imagine? They should take us to the toilet. Hey! Yeah, I'm just about to the toilet. No? Imagine. Adako. Hey! Hey! Hello. 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 That is the full story. Oja. You must return the bid to the rightful owner. As instructed, that is the only way we will stop having sleepless nights. Yes. Wise one. I will do as you have said. If only I can still have a peaceful sleep. You may leave. From um, as a mom, where you want to bring uh, that leaf, who is a mark of respect for your mother's people? Yes, Papa, I have it already. You have it already. Yes, Papa. Uh, because um, we'll travel very soon. Huh? Eh? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Papa. Eh? That reminds me. I overheard the chief guard telling us that he found the late Igwe Suya B. Royal what? The late Igwe Suya B. Royal B. Yes, Papa. Hey! You guys are only cares and why you have put on a village square. Eh? You guys are only cares and why you have put on a village square. Eh, Papa. It did not end there. He even said that the late king keeps appearing to him in his dream, asking him to return the bid to the rightful owner. 
So worried. Words have gotten to me like you've been eating your food. I'm a man. I can take care of myself. I know when to eat and when not to. <laughs> How was your day? Nothing serious. I only went swimming with Agu. And please, I want to be left alone. I'm your mother. What troubles you? You don't seem to trust me anymore. This has nothing to do with trust. I can't risk you whispering whatever I tell you to your husband in bed. What's the meaning of that? What is the meaning of that? You... I want to be left alone, mother. I want to be left alone. <sighs> the earlier you come to terms with all of this, the better for you. destiny you have to fulfill it these things coming in your dreams are for a reason Ike, papa said that there's no good road to the forest so how do i convince him that i want to embark on this journey honestly that worries me a lot but i believe that the gods have plans for you, Ago. Yes. I must talk to you. I must talk. The gods are with you, Ago. I can't sleep. Be strong, my brother. I must talk to you. The gods are with you. Ago. You mean the very same woman appeared to you again? So have you told um, your father about it yet? Yes. And I've talked to my father about it. And this goes a very serious journey. Agu, by the ghost, I, Ikemba, shall go with you. You just said that. My prince, this is not a journey we we'll go with cars. I also seek answers, Agu. I seek answers. What are you not telling me? Agu, and Nakrika. And what do you mean? Agu, remember I once told you that my father's death wasn't ordinary. Oja has confirmed it. Yes! That was why I couldn't see you yesterday as planned. See, what I'm about to tell you now, Agu, I can't even risk the least fly. 
hearing it. Let's go inside. Let's talk inside the car. Let's go. The prophecies are coming to light. Yes, she is only fulfilling her destiny. Destiny? In death? What is what? She gave her life for me. She gave her life for me. The moon lives in the sky. But its destiny is here on earth. There's a moon. Huh? You speak in virus. Go for your journey. All the answers to your questions lies in your path. Is him, what about her? What about her? She will be waiting for you. Go while you still have time. Go while you still have time. Take. To put an end to it. Bele, I don't mind. The greatest of all spiritual beings. Will know who was right. Thank you. Thank you very much. The moment you bury this, people will start dying in your kingdom. Then you shall carry out your plans of framing the Ezemo for being responsible for the calamities that has befallen the land. Bele, what about that, that small boy you came back? We tried to stop him, but as we speak, he's on his way to the forest. What should I do? He will fade with the wind. But if not, <laughs> <laughs> we shall remove him like a weed in a vegetable farm. Good. Good. That's what I want. Take. Take this. Place it in the palace. Then death shall be far away from the royal household. Bella. Thank you. Thank you.
What happened?
for two days now, nah, two days. We've been on this endless mission. No. Uh. I told you, this was not a journey with cars. Mama. Hey. Uh. Papa, have to move. I don't want to take some Have some water. Have some water. Give us to drink! Hey. 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 Give us to drink! Give it, give it, give it to me. Hey. Come on! Hey. 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 I know you! I go reject them. No. No! We are, we are not giving you. Uh -uh. This water is too small for for for. for I, I I am my friend now. Nah. Yes. Would I love to share with you? But the water is too small. I heard your wife just got delivered of a baby. Yes, it will. It bounces the baby. Yes. You must be happy. Very happy. I want to make you even more happy. Oti. Igwe. I have decided to make you rich. And not only that, from this moment, you shall become the new head of guards in this kingdom. Your hands. But, Oja, this. Oja, what? Huh? Whomever I choose as the chief guard of this kingdom becomes so. Hmm? Igwe, I shall, as you please, your highness. Good. Highness. <sighs> you will only have to do one thing. set my eyes on you came by my son for about three days now. Woman, do not disturb my peace. Your son is a grown-up and can take care of himself. What? I have not seen my son for the past three days and I, with all the strength is happening, I can't take Enough! Care. Woman! Enough! Leave my presence at once. Oh, 
Roger. My king. I believe there is something you would like to share with me. Not at all, my king. Really? Yes, my king. Mm. I, well, I was thinking there was a little secret you would have loved to share with your king. No, my king. No. Yes, my king. Oja. My king. Yeah. There has been rumors. People are talking. The birds singing and the walls listening. I heard you are in possession of the late Igor Deli's royal beat. No, but um my but king. What? I Oja. Yes, my king. So if you are in possession of the late king's feet. You are also in possession of the true story about what happened to him. No, my king, I am not aware. Hush. <laughs> give me your phone. <sighs> my king, just give it to me. I have been loyal to the throne. My king. Shh. Oti. My king. Hold on to this. Ah. ah, come on. There is no need to panic. <clears throat> like you said. I'm a merciful king. And, and, and of course, I will not act on account of rumors. Just wait for me right there. My king. Loyalty. Oja. My king. You know that I do not joke with loyalty. Oti. Uh -huh. My king. No, my king, my king, what is it? One loose end tied up. Oti! My king. Clean up the mess. And catch up with me. <laughs> Things are getting out. We can't stand by here, I just watch. Hmm? Ma! Ooh, we must do something. Ma! Hmm? Hmm? Ma? Ma! Igwe! 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 What is it? Oti! Your Highness. Where is Oja? Igwe! My eyes have seen what my mouth cannot say. Speak. Igwe, when I got to the shrine to return the message, I was commanded. When I got there, what I saw, my mouth is forbidden. To say. I am your king and I command you to speak. Igwe, when I got to the shrine to return the message, I was commanded. I saw Kima, the widow. They were making love inside the shrine. Hey! Aru, Nene, abomination. So he has got to the extent of them making love in the shrine of the land. What a sacrilege. In the shrine of a community. No! Gods! Highness. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Go with Oti and bring Ezemmo and the widow right back here at once. Yes, Highness. Go. There must be stoned to death for, for committing this sacrilege in this kingdom. Thank you. 
Please, if you don't know what to say, you sit down. From the way you are behaving, you don't know what to say. You have no point to make. Take your seat and shut up your mouth. Please, sit down. There's no time for trivialities. For Greek marriage. Please. There is nothing to be different. My verdict stands. For the sacrilege that you committed in this kingdom, they shall be stoned to death. Yes. Yes. That's our law. That's our law. If there's your niggas and why I wanna do this square. Yahoo! Yahoo! It is. <laughs> My elders. <laughs> this accusation is false. I did not do it. I am innocent. I have not seen this anymore for the past two months. Why will somebody do this to me? Why? I've always known that the pitu that eats up the tobar of yam will find his way home to the surface. Cry not, woman. The innocent only gets justice from the gods. But be it known to the people of Obidike that I have done no such sacrilege. What she has done calls for death. <laughs> but for my kind heart, I will temper justice with mercy. Leave OPDK right now and never return. You are both banished. The day you set your feet in OPDK will be the last. Take them away. <laughs> away. Your highness, I'm innocent, please. My elders! Oh no! Oh. You know about this dead woman? Banish! Hey, my elders! Please, don't do this to me! Take them away! I am not a little! Come on! Babies, you need kids and wine. Because they want to be this way. Can I imagine that? My daughter is on her phone. He's only an unborn child that knows. I can tell the movement of a child in the belly. Hmm. When a child passes through Gede, she would not know that through Gede is the dance of the spirits. Hmm. I go, son of a here. You call me as if you know me. And yet, I've not seen your face. I am the goddess of the third mountain. I have an eye everywhere. Even at the back of my head. <laughs> Welcome. He came back. The son of Igwe Adili. The third of Obidike kingdom. You are highly welcome. You even know me. I know you. Can I sit? I saw. I 
basic answers to why you keep appearing in my videos. <laughs> This is what you see. The gods are indeed mysterious. Igemba, Ago is your destiny. Igemba, you are her destiny. And she is Ago's destiny. I don't understand what you mean. What do you mean by it? She's his destiny. It's my destiny. And I'm mad. Get you. This is too much. This is Adore. She was born the day the moon went to the sun. Likewise, he came by here. If you notice, there is a strange mark under your right leg. Likewise, Adure, she had the same mark under her left leg. This one. I have this mark on the right, but I don't know what it means. She is a living dead. It is your destiny, Kemba, to be her battle. Same way, Ago, it was his own destiny to bring you here. If not Ago's dream, you wouldn't have been here to bring the living dead back to life. I understand what you mean by she is my destiny. I am his destiny. But what I don't understand is what show is living this The girls are wise. Time shut What do I do it? Do what? Bring the living dead back to life. For the life of one, one must go. Impossible. How do you expect me to do what you ask of me? Why 
Why did he say I should not partake in the royal cup? I hope you give my see. I still love him. I just wanted royalty. Should I go and warn him? No. Pa Papa said I should stay here. He said I shouldn't go there. I hope he came by safe. Igwe! Greetings! Yes, how are that? Thank you very much, you're welcome. Igwe! This is Gola. My people. We have color. On your with the Lord, with the Lord. He that brings color not brings life. And as we all eat from this color not, may it give us abundant life. <laughs> My orders, please. Let's all eat from this. Oh no. from this royal cup in celebration of the victory we just achieved against the calamity that befell us. My people, I can hear moon. Oh, no. No. <clears throat> no. <laughs> My people, I shall drink from this royal cup, and so shall all of you.
the prophecy has been fulfilled. A mighty wind shall blow across the land. <sighs> And I'll be there to tell the tale. the luckiest in the eastern region yes. but we are the first kingdom endowed with mineral resources so as rich as uranium you know how far uranium can go in developing a nation eh? the white men are ready to come down and settle yes once we give up over More than the amount of money. Afterwards, they will develop our lands. Yes. We are talking about hospitals. Oh, I'm talking about real estate institutions. Let the sun rise and set up what we need. For the first time. So now we respect our supremacy. Oh, the members of this land will be wiped out. Our citizens will die. 
Yes, you will have it. Ah. I'll let him. Now I understand what she meant. Because I'm the king and I'm sitting on the throne to raise Ikimba's son, it means I am Ikimba's destiny. And because Ikimba brought the living dead back to life, that means Ikimba is Adora's destiny. And Adora is my destiny because she's my wife and the queen from the gods. <laughs> the gods are wise. Grace. 
What a shame. Please don't finish that one, so close for me. Pull up last.